Good morning, it's Mr. Toops, the Jedi I believe, and today it's Tuesday, it's Cinco de Bo. <laughs> it's May 5th. <clears throat> Yesterday we talked about how there's times when you're in a contest or you're faced to do a task, and sometimes you're like a mule in the Kentucky Derby, and you could just finish the race. You're not going to win every single time. Times when you're in an athletic contest and the people you're playing just might have more talents, might be physically bigger, and you just do the best you can. If you improve despite losing, you're getting better, and that's when your character is forged and molded. We're going to kind of continue on this this week on how contests and how athletic contests forge you and mold you and who you are. Okay, today's phrase is phrase 133. This comes from a lot of coaching here, okay? I coached uh, junior high athletics for three years, learned a lot, okay? So phrase 133 says, when a champion loses, his character is made stronger. When a loser loses, he finds excuses for losing. This is pretty powerful. When a champion loses, his character is made stronger. When a loser loses, he finds excuses for losing. When you lose, and like I said, sometimes you're not going to win every single time. Life isn't fair. Everyone has different talents, okay? But when you lose, if you figure out why you lose and you improve on that, your character is made stronger. That's how champions should respond to not being successful because you won't be successful every single day. But when a loser loses, he finds excuses. When you start making excuses, contentment will never, ever reach your heart. You'll always be blaming others. Eventually, you'll blame others for everything, and you'll hold grudges, and those grudges will rot your inner soul and destroy your relationships with others. So when you don't succeed, adapt and overcome and find out why you didn't succeed and try to improve. This is a great source of inspiration and should guide you every day. I hope you have a great day today. Enjoy your Cinco de Mayo. Remember, you are amazing. You were created to do wonderful things. Mr. Toops loves you and always believe.